Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So today I'll be using Daisy and Katie collection with the Dose of Color, which is round two collection of theirs with Dose of Color. So obviously I've got their eyeshadow palette, I've got their highlighter, and obviously I've got their liquid lipstick. Now if you are not sure whether to get the palette or not, I mean as in like whether the pigmentation look exactly like in the pictures or not, how the product feels like, and also how to get this look, then please keep on watching. Okay, so first off, I'm just gonna go into the palette and then just start off with the eyes. The first color that I'm gonna use is called Basic, which is this one, and I've already concealed my eyes so that I want that color to you know pop. So I'm just gonna use this color Basic first to just set that base. So I'm just gonna take a flat shaded brush and then just set my base first. So the color that is really really popping to me right now is this color which is called a moment so i'm just gonna try to use that color today but however to make it work i'm just gonna play around with other color first so the first color that i'm gonna take is now this color which is called kuros right here so with that i'm just gonna go into my crease first so i'm just gonna take it very lightly and then start applying that color right in my crease I can see that this is a very lovely color but at the same time it blends it so well. I really really love this color. I'm moving on to next color is called Sheen which is this color right here which is dark deep brown color. I'm just gonna take that color and then deepen my outer crease. As I'm starting to blend that color in my eyes, I can really feel the texture of the eyeshadow. It is really really smooth. You can feel the color like blending it so well. It has that buttery feeling. Uh, this eyeshadow I can say that it's very very good quality. Next color that I really want to use from this palette is this blue color it's called a moment and uh, as you can see that it has that holographic feeling in there so i really want to see how it looks like on my eyes i'm just gonna dive into this color and then start applying right on the center of my eyelid and then slowly i'm just gonna build up that color as i'm starting to apply this color i can feel the smoothness of it and i really really like it because when the eyeshadow is like a glitter base, especially this kind of holographic. You kind of feel like the eyeshadow is going to be chunky, and obviously there are going to be a lot. Uh, obviously there is going to be a lot of fallout. But I can notice that even though this is falling out a little bit, I can see that I can really easily blend this color with the other color, which is really nice because. Sometimes when you go overboard with the color or something like that, you want to blend in the color. What happens is that the chunky glitter tends to move along everywhere and it gets really, really messy. But I can see that this one with this one, I can really go into other color and then just blend the color again. Okay, I just want to put on one more color on my eyes because I'm just excited to use this palette and all this color. And I'm just going to go into this color which is called Just a Kiss right there. So I'm just going to take a brush and then apply that right in the inner corner of my eyes. I'm just loving how it's turning out. So I'm just going to line my eyes using Joeva Black Box Cat Eye Liner Pen. So right there. Moving on to the base, I'm just going to go into my NARS foundation which is in the shade Stromboli. So after foundation, I'm going to move on to my concealer. For concealer, I'm going to take my Becca Luminous Perfecting Concealer, which is in the shade Beige. I'm just going to go into my Lower Mercier Translucent Powder and set that concealer right there in my eyes so that I can finish up my eye look. So I'm just going to leave the powder right there to let it set for a while and then I'm going to go into my palette and finish my eye look. So I'm just going to take this color which is called Kuros first and I'm going to apply it right on the lower lash line. Next I'm going to go into this color which is called a moment and I'm just going to apply that color right on top of the Kuros color that we just applied. Okay, I'm just going to finish off the whole look by using the black eyeliner and this is from the Too Faced. I'm going to line my lower lash line and upper lash line and also I'm just going to put on some lashes and then come back to you guys. Now moving on to the bronzer, I'm just going to go into my Tom Ford bronzer and then start bronzing my face quickly. 
Okay, now moving on to the highlighter. This is the part that I'm really, really excited about. They came up with two highlighter. One is called Figo and one is called Chasing the Sun. Figo is from their last collection, which was really high in demand and it was sold out everywhere. And guess what? It is sold out again. So I got my hand on Chasing the Sun. I really wanted to get both of them, but obviously Figo was sold out again. I couldn't get anything from their first collection because it wasn't available in UK during that time. But this time around, the second round is sold here in Beauty Bay which I couldn't miss out in any way so Chasing the Sun is a really really lovely uh, golden base highlighter which is I'm really excited about so I'm just gonna take a highlighter brush oh my god oh my god it's coming through it's coming through Fugo is a bit on the silvery base so I think it's gonna look nicer on more of like a fair complexion and I think this is perfect for my complexion so anyone who is around my complexion go for this one if you really want it and for people who are lighter than my complexion you can really go for the Fugo Okay, so moving on to the lips, they have come up with two liquid lipstick and two traditional lipstick. Now, I'm not a big fan of traditional ones, so I'm just going to move on to the liquid lipstick. Now, the two color is a mauve story and my man. Now, for this look, I'm just going to go into the color my I'm just going to go into the color my man because I think it perfectly suits this eye color. So let's just see how the color looks like. And for the lips today, I'm not going to use any lip pencil because I really want to see the color, the true color of this liquid lipstick. So there you go. I like it. It feels really, really soft and buttery. I've always been a big fan of uh, liquid lipstick from Dose of Color, but this one is to the next level. It is so soft and smooth. It doesn't feel like I'm wearing anything on my lips. It's really, really nice. I really love the color. There you go guys, that's the finished look and I hope that you guys enjoy watching me review on the Daisy and Katie collection with the Dose of Color which is round 2 and I really wanted to go and dive into their eyeshadow palette as soon as I saw them and I am really really happy how it turned out and also I can tell that this is a really really good eyeshadow because as I started blending those color, it was really blending it well, like a buttery feeling, very smooth. So I would definitely recommend for this palette. And moving on to the highlighter as well. Oh my god, um, I think this is going to be my favorite highlighter right now because when it comes to highlighter, sometimes it can be like to a point where it's like too much highlighter and some are there like you can't really see it and some are like really glittery chunky one but I can see this highlighter is so smooth it feels like it's kind of like natural glow I mean like from within your skin instead of like feeling that you know you have put on highlighter so I can say that this is a really really good highlighter and I think this is gonna be my favorite highlighter now also moving on to the liquid lipstick i've always been a fan of dose of color liquid lipstick and once again they have done it i really love this color and the other color as well i might try to use it in my other tutorial but for now for this look i really love this color so this is called my main color and i really really love it so far i really love all the collection whatever i've got most of them were obviously out of stock so obviously I couldn't get hands on their lip glosses which I really really wanted to because it looks really amazing whenever people put it on them. So if I get my chance I uh, will obviously get it. But for now if you are new to my channel please feel free to subscribe to my channel and if you are already subscribed to my channel make sure that you hit that notification bell down there. It will really help to make sure that it notifies you every single time I upload. So yeah with that being said I would like to sign up for now. Until next time stay beautiful and I love you all. Mm. I'm starting. Ah. Mm -mm -mm.
let's just say it again. No, 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 don't say that. That. Kirei. Actually, gusto ba? Wished. <laughs>